Hi, I'm Jerry James Stone, and in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to make cauliflower rice. Cauliflower rice is wonderful for so many different things. I use it as a way just to introduce more vegetables into whatever I'm eating, so it's a great addition to, aside from just making a rice with it, it's great to add to pasta sauces, add to scrambles. You'd barely even know it's there because cauliflower has a nice neutral flavor and the rice bits are so small that you don't even realize it. It's wonderful. And today I'm gonna show you how to make cauliflower rice in a few different ways. But before I get into that, I just wanna remind you, I have a handful of cauliflower recipes on my blog here. So be sure to check those out. I have cauliflower pizza crust. I have everything you could possibly think of that's tasty with cauliflower. So be sure to check out that playlist and let's get into making cauliflower rice, okay? So the first thing you need is obviously a head of cauliflower and you're just gonna go ahead and remove all of the green leaves and the stems, just cut those off. All you want left is the florets. Okay, those are chopped off. You don't necessarily have to throw these away. This is great for making soup stock with, just so you know. Now that we've cut off the greens, we're just gonna cut off the individual florets. You don't have to be like, you know, you can just kind of chop it off because you're gonna throw it in a food processor so it doesn't really have to be perfect. Or you're gonna be grating it with a cheese grater, whatever is easiest. If you don't have a food processor, you can easily make cauliflower rice just using a simple cheese grater. Though it is a lot more work. If you have a food processor, just add in a couple equal sized florets using the blade attachment and just pulse it until they're all chopped up. Just like that. There you go, you have your cauliflower rice. This is uh, great if you wanna, you know, you can just saute it with a little bit of oil in a fry pan and then serve whatever you would normally serve over rice. It's great for sneaking into marinara sauce if you wanna add extra vegetables into your diet and maybe not know that they're there. Um, you can have it with some enchiladas, you know, great in tacos, however you wanna use it, but super easy to make and a great way to add more veggies to whatever you're eating. See, not too hard, right? It's a little bit of work, but like I said, it's a really great, great way to add more vegetables to whatever it is that you're eating. It works great in scrambles, omelets, sauces, whatever. Please try it out. Let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. And if you're a new time viewer, hey, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time.